is the Petit Rit, Petit Rit or Puchi Rit Su, uh, depending on where you're looking at the listing. Castor Nero Claudius from Fate Grand Order. So there's Petit Rit's Castor down there. Is by Bandai Spirits. Uh, so these little kits are a good alternative to Nendroids. What are Nendroids? Well, they are small in scale and kind of GB esque in proportion figures, which come with usually with a set of accessories. But since they're figures, you don't actually construct them. This is Nendroid Ricola, I think. And she is from... Is she from Dog Days? I think she's from Dog Days. One of the little helper characters. And quite a bit heavier. But a pretty similar... Uh, scale in uh, proportion mostly somewhat maybe this was drifting because I was on the markers now this one did come with stickers especially for the bathing suit because it's supposed to be striped and you know, I'll show you on here but I messed them up and couldn't put them on right. So I took them back off. And of course, you have to use the stand because otherwise it's going to fall down all the time. Also, there are no stickers for the sword. So I opted to paint inside of the cannons and on there. And also on there, I painted a bit on there and then used my file and an eraser to clean up the mess that was left because I do often leave messes. And these turret things are mounted on a ball joint. Of course that's Bandai's uh, gold color. I can take that, take her from the stand for a bit to give you a better look. Uh, I did paint these rather than using the stickers again because the stickers seemed like a bad idea overall. Head goes up that far, down that far, tilting side to side. Rotation would go all the way if I moved the sword out of the way. I said out of the way. Uh, no giddy no robot chicken or anything like that. Arm goes up until it can't no more because of the big head. But she can touch the side of her head, which I don't think many uh, super deformed type characters can. There is a cut over here, it looks like. Yes, for a rotation. But you have to hold on very strongly or you'll lose the grip on it. Can bend 90 degrees for the arm and even a bit the other way. And hand just rotates because it's a peg. Expecting bus to move. This is a very simple model. The bow can rotate around until it starts to hit stuff. Leg up that far, sideways that far, back the furthest. Ankle, the one without the uh, little water scrunchie. It's the one with the scrunchie goes like this, side to side. Front, back, side to side, front, back, rotation, and rotation. Pretty cool and cute looking figure. 
costs maybe fifteen dollars unless you get on sale for less than ten not including shipping uh, so it just goes in the hand it's very simple you could use it I think just as easily in any other model let me try Oops. Maybe not, it might be thinner. No, that would work. Just have to be lucky that we sandwich this properly. Yeah. So it can work, it is just a little bit loose. into the hand. And also with you. Mm, I don't see anything else in the box, which means that I either used up everything or threw it out, unfortunately. Uh, let's see. Just plug her back in there. And that's just the way she is. 